Hello, this is Haka the Bean. I'm here with uh, some barely legible cringe called Star Kids Prophecy. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please like the video, subscribe down below, and comment down below and comment. If you don't like the video, I will completely understand. Since we're going to Wattpad for this cringe. Let's start with the alliances. Okay, so like I said, this is my first story. Be nice, please. BTW, it said after our sunset, so. Thunder Clan, Leader, Firestar, Ginger Tom with a flame colored pelt, Deputy Brambleclaw, Dark Brown Tabby Tom with <sighs> Amber Eyes, Medicine Cat, Jay Feather, Music Great A Tom, Warriors, Squirrel Flight, Dark Ginger, she cat with green eyes. Apprentice Fox Paw. Dust Pelt. Dark Brown Tabby Tom. Sand and Storm. Pale Ginger She Cat. Cloud Tail. Long haired White Tom. Apprentice Daisy Paw. Green in long furred cat from the horse place. Bracken Fur. Golden Brown Tabby Tom. Sorrow Tail. Taurus Joe. All in white she cat with amber eyes. Thorn claw. Golden brown tabby tom. Bredheart. White she cat with ginger patches. Sweater leg. Long live the black tom with the brown underbelly and amber eyes. I personally remember loving the warrior cats, but this clearly isn't about that. White wing. White she cat with green eyes. Apprentice Ice Paw, Birch Fall, Light Brown Tabby Tom, Gray Stripe, Long Haired Gray Tom, Berry Nose, Cream Colored Tom, Hazeltail, Small Gray and White She Cat, Mouse Whisker. I'm done undescribing these. Cinderheart, Poppy Frost, Honey Firm, Lion Blaze, Holly Leaf, Fox Heart, Ice Fire, Toad Rivet, <laughs> Rose Flame, Briar Storm, Bumble Flower, Blossom Wind, Princess, Fox Daisy Paw, Flame Paw, Lake Paw. The last two are Star Kids Sisters. No, sorry, kids, sitters. Jazz Paul, red she cat with blue eyes and a black tail. Queens. <sighs> Fern Cloud, Dawn Sparkle. And kids, star kid, the, the protagonist. Grayish blue and purple she cat with molting orange eyes and a white star on her forehead. Elders Longtail, Mouse Fur, Weasel Pelt, Leaf Pool. Shadow Clan. The leader is Black Paw with a deputy of Reset Fur. This seems already like it's a bit off from the timeline. But maybe I don't remember too well. Apprentice is Flame Paw. Warrior is Oak Fur. Apprentice is, is Tiger Paw. Rowan Paw. Smoke Fur. Right. Apprentice is Owl Paw. Ivy Tail. Apprentice Dawn Paw. Toadfoot. Crow Frost. Apprentice is Olive Paw. 
it's hard to read this because I kind of forgot a lot of the stuff that happens in these in the original books. King Fur. I'm not even gonna try and think about that. Rat Scar, Francis of Shrewpal, Snake Tail, Francis Scorchpaw, uh, White Water, Francis Redpaw, Tiny Pelt, Flame Wind, Tiger Claw. Surprise that he's not Tiger Star. Dawn Feather. And I guess their princess is Alifa, Prince Snowbird, Outer Cedar Heart, Top of Hoppy, and now we get Wind Clan. The leader being One Star, Deputy being Ashfoot, Messing Cat being Barkface. <laughs> That's kind of a funny name. Princess being Kestrel Paw. Where is our Tornier? Ear? Crowfeather, Owl Whisker, White Tail, Night Cloud, Gorse Tail, Weasel Fur, Hairspring, Leaf Tail, Apprentice uh, Isopaw, Dew Spot, Apprentice Sedge Paw, Willow Claw, Apprentice Swallow Paw, Ant Pelt, Amber, Amber Fruit, Apprentice Sun Paw, Header Tail, Freezer, Ease Pelt, Elder, our Morning Flower, and with Vert. River Clan with the leader, Leopard Star, the Deputy Missy Foot. Was that her name the original? I don't remember. I do remember Mothwing the Medicine Cat and their apprentice Willow Shine. With the Warriors Black Claw, Voltooth, Apprentice Middle Paw. Red Whisker, Moss Pelt, a Princess Pebble Paw, Beach Fur, Ripple Tail, a Princess Mellow Paw. Wait. No. Moss Paw's a Princess Pebble Paw. I misread. Grey Mist, Dawn Flower, Dapple Nose, Pounce Tail, Mint Fur, a Princess Nettle Paw, Otter Heart, a Princess Sneeze Paw, Pine Fur, a Princess Robin Paw, Rainstorm, Dusk Fur, Apprentice Copper Paw, Queen's Ice Wing, Mother Beetle Kit, Frickle Kit, Petal Kit, and Grass Kit, Elders, Heavy Step, Swallowtail, and Stone String. Oh boy. Now we get to Chapter Owen, the Prologue. Finally, something to read. <laughs> Not much, apparently. The cats gathered around a the pool. They looked into it eagerly. A dark shape appeared on the on the surface. A blue she cat looked up. Her eyes were bright. This is a prophecy, she said. Out of the darkness. Stars will come and get rid of the evil tiger and holly. It's about to start, kid, a white tom said. She's going to save the forest. He looked at a gold old tom by blue star who. She has powers nobody dreamed of, said the gold tom. Do we tell Jay Feather? Yes. Yes, said blue star. He needs to know. She walked away from the pool to tell Jay the feather about the prophet key. Did you like it? Please tell me in an um, review. <laughs> of all of the prologues that I've skipped in Warrior Cats, that's gotta be the shortest one. Let's try out chapter two, The Rose of a Hero of a Heroine. I don't know who Jazzy Coon is, but I guess we'll get into it. Okay, Jazzy Coon, please don't get mad at me because you're not in it yet. You'll appear soon, don't worry. I'm just gonna assume that whoever this Jazzy Coon is, they don't want to be even involved in this. 
Stark had to walk up and sun led to poison the branches. She closed her eyes again, still tired. But her, her mom wouldn't let her sleep, not today. Sweetie, it's time to get up, said Don Sparkle, her eyes shining. Today is important today. What is it? At mom, said Sarkit, awake right away. Then she can't remember what today it was. Oh my gosh, it's my ceremony today! She squealed exercisedly. Today was the day she was an apprentice. She flicked it out outside, not even waiting for her mom. But her mom caught it up to her quick. Oh, weird, um, fan fiction, I guess. So, you know, the clients on, on accept cats like, like, like us sometimes, she said. So I glared. She didn't, didn't like being big told that. That's because her mom was as a used to Shadow Clan cat, her dad was Jay Fetter the Master Cat. Didn't mean she was different. Starfall, come here, said the fire sorry from the leg. He jumped down. Sarkhead, it's time for you to become an apprentice, he said. You're a strong, brave cat, and because of that, I will mentor you. Everybody gasped. Sarka did too. She heard her mother say, Wow! Sarka liked her shoulder. It was in her ear. Go be the best there ever was, Starpaw. I know it. We're the best around. Wait, that was a wrong song anyway. Surprise, she walked away when they were done howling for her. Then she went to offer to Jay Feather and Don Sarker, who were very a prod. Dot, it, it's, were a very happy, but he have some to say some things to Jay Feather. His chest puffed up to it. You see, there is this prof, prof key, Sarkon, ape me it. Said that out of the dark, the stars will come and get rid of the evil tiger and holly. Sarfar gasped. <gasps> what could it mean? <laughs> well, I update it fast, don't I? Review or I'll hit you over the head with a frying pan. My, my goodness. I'll see some of these notes. Never mind, I regret that immediately. Let's just continue. I think I was reading one more thing before I stop for today. <sighs> Thanks, Jesse Q, for it. Good review. And stop making the story. I bet you can't set, write such a good story. I mean, I could eventually tell the backstory of my character. It might be a, a, a little bit more cringe than this, but at least it would be readable. <laughs> so far. I walked, walked over to the princess den. Inside, she, no, instead she saw her, her sisters, her flame paw and lake paw, and her friend, jazz paw. Jazz, yeah, you're my BFF. Was sleeping on the moss. Jazz paw, get up! She cried. Jazz paw opened her brilliant blue eyes and looked at her. 
hour. Do you want to go on patrol with me? She asked. This is hard to read. I'm trying to keep the typos in, but it's hard to not just automatically correct them. Sure, said Jasper, getting up from the moss. They leaped and went to the entrance to camp. And then a cat came in through the entrance. It was Black Star! Weird assumption here. Shao Clan are attacking, she yelled. All the cats came out from their dens. Wow. Good j She jumped on a cat and clawed him and he ran off. I'm just imagining that she jumped on a random cat that was just around and just... I saw them and they just ran off. Good job, Starpaw, Firestar called. The last cat I knew that could fit like, like that was Sandstorm. You're a good fitter. Starpaw was happy. She was a good fitter. Maybe this was what the prof, the, a prof key meant. Thanks, and please no more flame. Alright. <laughs> I don't know how you could enjoy this, but I hope that you somehow found a way to somehow enjoy whatever this was. I might continue it, I might not. All I know is that it was kind of funny. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.